Hi, I'm Lisa Ruffholm with Scientific Nutrition, and today I want to talk to you a little bit about copper toxicity symptoms. So you might want to grab a pen and a piece of paper and make some check marks in case you've ever encountered these symptoms or you're currently struggling with them because about 90% or more of my clients come to me with copper toxicity. So let's get to them. Um, they would include acne, adrenal insufficiency or fatigue, uh, allergies, alopecia, arthritis, connective tissue issues, autism is related to this, this copper toxicity, um, epilepsy and seizures, or hair and nail weaknesses, um, migraines, high cholesterol, cancer and diabetes. Uh, estrogen imbalance is a big one with copper because birth control and those type of things can be linked to it. Hyperthyroidism, which is a fast thyroid, uh, infections, multiple sclerosis, inflammation, insomnia, mitocardial infarction. So if you have that, you know what that is. Um, there's nausea, PMS, some dental cavities can have that link, scoliosis, uh, U UTI or urinary tract infection. Skin conditions is a big one. And when you are detoxing, these will flare up often in the form of acne or rashes, that type of thing. Also, it can affect our mental wellness, which would be anxiety and panic attacks, mind racing, mood swings, even schizophrenia, depression, and bipolar disorder. So it really does affect us greatly. And if you'd like some information on sources or possible sources that are inf um, affecting you, then hop over to my link and on my blog, I'll list those for you. If you think you might be having this issue or want a little help with it, I would love to have a talk with you and see what we can do to help you feel comfortable, kick these symptoms to the curb, and I hope to hear from you soon. Thanks so much and have a good day. Bye-bye.